What about little people like me? You talk a lot in the book about what does it take to steer the culture of a company in a significant enough way that they make this investment. It's a big investment. It re involves culture change, right? I would say not exactly because I've been an employee in big companies. I've worked with Fortune 100 companies and small companies. And here's what I know. It's almost impossible to change culture. There's only one way to change culture, and that is the leader at the top. The leader at the top sets the tone for the company. There's no such thing as a grassroots cultural change. Your culture is your marketing. That's what shows up. If we have creators, solopreneurs, small business owners also watching this vodcast, what are the questions that we should be asking to build a community that will give our companies lasting value? As a startup, what do you need? You need advice. You need advocates. You need people to test things and try to break it. That's just an amazing strategy for an entrepreneur. Just get some people together and say, hey, let's work on this together and give me a little bit of your time and let's see if we can get this to work. For someone like you, an entrepreneur, I to think about, well, what's the impact I want to have on this world. What's my message? And how could I make that impact in a bigger way if other people came along with me? Are there other people who are rowing this boat? And you say, let's get in the same boat and all row together. We'll have a bigger impact. Mm -hmm. We can be better together, pushing each other, teaching each other, learning together.